When designing O, we wanted to make sure that our game had simple and intuitive controls that would allow anyone to pick up the game and play, but we really wanted a unique selling point that would make our game stand out from others, and that's where our corruption system came into play in our responsive environment that changed based off the player's interactions. To help implement these interactions, we created a dynamic pipeline to work with the level designers. These interactions were focused on the different modular systems that we created. These systems include the different cube types that we made, which fall into two categories, supportive cubes and obstacle cubes. We implemented these two cube variations to control the game's difficulty flow and to make sure the player is fairly challenged. Going into this project, we needed to make sure that each level had a cohesive flow. To do this, we had to establish a natural progression from one level to the next. But we didn't want the levels to feel repetitive, so we came up with different challenges to make each level feel unique. This way we could create an enjoyable experience for the player. I chose a very minimalist art aesthetic to go with the very simple design mechanic within our game. I also chose a very sleek, saturated look to go with our models to make them seem a lot more interesting. A very abstract appearance to go with the lack of narrative and to allow players making their own subjective opinions on the look of our game. We realized quickly that in order for this game to be possible, we would have to develop a level editor. We focused on making it easy to use, extendable, and most of all efficient. Through iteration and feedback, we were able to make a tool that didn't limit our designer's creativity. In order to support the corruption mechanic, we had to create systems to improve immersion. These included the world's colors changing, environments collapsing, and our dynamic soundtrack. For that, we used the WISE audio engine to create a shifting soundscape that reflects the state of the world. Infinitely Cool Industries is one of the most creative and driven teams I've had the pleasure to work with. Their determination and passion is what made this game possible.